Trader Joe's, your local neighborhood grocery store with unique food items you can't find anywhere else. Well, it turns out you can find a lot of those exclusive items at any national supermarket chain, just under a different brand name. Here's the thing about Trader Joe's, they don't manufacture any products themselves, which means they need the help of some major brands to manufacture products for them. But Trader Joe's is notoriously tight-lipped about where they source their products. However, through some thorough comparisons of looks, taste, and ingredients lists, people have been able to fairly confidently source where Trader Joe's products come from, like Stacy's Pita Chips, which are made by Frito-Lay, a division of PepsiCo, which have identical ingredients to Trader Joe's Pita Chips or Trader Joe's crispy, crunchy cookies, which are near identical in taste, ingredients, and packaging to Tate's Bake Shop cookies. The list goes on and on, but because of Trader Joe's secret of nature, we can't say with 100% confidence who's actually manufacturing these products. But the source of some Trader Joe's products have been confirmed in an unlikely and somewhat unfortunate way, product recalls. Given the nature of product recalls, they have to be public knowledge. So a quick search of the FDA's website gives some valuable insight into who's actually manufacturing for them. Some of these brands include Naked Juice, which is also a PepsiCo brand, Tribe Mediterranean Foods, and Wonderful Pistachios. So why does Trader Joe's care so much about concealing the brands that they work with? Well, between the local art on the walls, the handwritten signs, and Trader Joe's branding on near every product, they want you to believe they're still a small scale local operation with unique tasting foods and they very much succeed at that. In a taste test conducted by Eater.com, consumers more often found the Trader Joe's product to be better tasting than the identical product from the big brand that manufactures it. On the other hand, big brands don't want to reveal that they source products for Trader Joe's. This would alert consumers that they can buy the same products at their supermarket, which the brand sells at a premium, for much cheaper at Trader Joe's. It is worth noting that Trader Joe's, however, does work with a decent amount of small manufacturers as well. They like to hold them into exclusive contracts, only manufacturing for Trader Joe's to ensure they do still have some unique items on their shelves. All in all, for a company that does no marketing or advertising outside of their own fearless flyer, Trader Joe's is a unique success story with a unique business model and some unique items. Oh, and uh, 19 cent bananas. Hey, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. If you liked the video, it would mean a lot to me if you went and pressed that like button. Or if you want to see more, press subscribe. I'm brand new to YouTube, so I hope to see you back here again, and I'll see you in the next one.